Hello and welcome to our little trip to the Peak District. We're at Longnor Wood uh, Camping and Caravanning Park and it's an absolutely fantastic site. A little bit out of the way. But then again, it's good going over them roads. <laughs> yeah, the roads, uh, uh, you have to pick your route. you definitely got to pick your route when yeah. you come in here, don't you? Yeah. Because uh, if you don't, then uh, it can be, oh, that's not good with the sun, is it? Nope. Let's move there, that's better. Right, <laughs> yeah, so on the, if you come in here, you do have to uh, pick your route. Definitely pick your route. <laughs> and uh, Google Maps is definitely one that you will make use of on the way here. So Long No Wood Holiday Park. We're going to start just as you enter ah. into the park, which is before we are here. But what? by the way, remind them, adult only park. Yeah, so this is uh, Tranquil Touring and it's an adult only park. So which it's is a, quite like. Yeah, uh, we're on a fully surfaced pitch, although there are just hook up pitches. Yeah. And there's also some lodges, some statics and a small teal a small teal a small field for <laughs> tents tents uh, so we'll have a we'll have a wander around uh, what we will say about this park is the present owners have had the park for we believe around about 16 years or so and in all the time they've had it it's been adult only so uh, you'll see the little picnic areas and things like that but we'll take it uh, just back a little bit from where we are. So we can see the views. Was, some of the views. Some of the views. Which are really nice. If you like views, we like views. We like walks. And hopefully, this is being shot, by the way, on the new Sony ZV-1, uh, which we've not used for vlogging outside before. No. So we're hoping that... Everything's all right. Everything's all right, and at least, well, hopefully we've got some sound. Yes. Uh, so it's a bit of a guess. Right. We'll turn you around and let you have a quick can look at... Can I turn you up a bit? Get you on the horizon. <gasps> look at them views. Yeah. Views to die for. Well, so we'll start there at the road, and we'll just pan you around sort of 180 ish and hopefully the picture will stay reasonably good and once we get around this side of course we're going to get the sun we're going to get the sun and i won't be able to see an absolute thing on the screen but there you are just behind us is a 10 acre dog walking field half of which is fully enclosed so you can let the dogs off the lead and let them run as much as you like. Uh, absolutely superb, isn't it, for dogs for oh, yeah, walking brilliant. in the area, brilliant. mountain biking, anything of that nature. Let us know, by the way, about the camera and the sound, uh, whether the picture, uh, whether the picture's stable, uh, because this. Uh, no gimbal of course, we're just on a selfie stick so hopefully it'll be a reasonable experience We're walking into the site now 
and uh, yeah as we walk towards the site and walk in uh, so yeah just drop us a comment let us know what you think about the sound and the picture we are going to also mix it up because we have got the little DJI pocket with us so we're going to do some of the filming with that that should make it a little bit easier for you so we'll just get to the sort of reception area and we'll come back to you very shortly right so when you arrive like all the sites it's key card barrier uh, you do need to leave a five pound deposit to get the card and I'm presuming that's because people are going home with their cards and they cost a fortune to replace and when you get here where we were just before is where you would park your car your motorhome caravan and walk up to reception to check in once you've checked in there is a small booth holding all the information leaflets for everything that's round and about a few picnic tables yeah small lawn there isn't there yeah there's a few picnic tables if you want to picnic down this way it's maybe it's for them who were in tents mm, so they're not sitting in the tents all the time right visitors are allowed uh, but they need to check in at reception and also park in this visitors bay which is just above the part of the site where they have the uh, fully are these seasonal pitches the seasonal and pitches. there's also some the live there. yeah and the down the bottom is some lodges now these are occupied so we're not going to go in that direction before we go in the uh, main part of the site we'll show you around or Ali will show you around uh, the toilet facilities right <clears throat> these are the ladies toilets the ladies things as you see here which is nice You've got a toilet and a wash and basin. It's a cubicle, so you're private to go to the toilet and give yourself a good wash. And there's one, two, three of them. The next cubicle is the toilet with the wash and basin. And you have a proper shower. And I had a shower in here last night. And it is. It's fantastic. Really nice to have a shower in a proper shower cubicle. And it's nice to have a toilet and a wash hand basin. I'm going back a bit now so you can see. I'm going to take you further along the ladies' toilets. And the next one on the end is a sink. A shower. I think this one, because it's so wide and it's got, I'll have to try and zoom out a bit, it's got the shower cubicle and the toilet, the toilet's there, and it is so wide, as you can see as I come round, this is a, a disabled one. You've got one, two, they're quite big showers, and hot just really really nice and clean they keep it really nice and clean there's a hair dryer and everything here everything here it's really nice and clean all they do ask you to do is keep the door shut that's all they do ask and it's really really clean and i'm off out now okay so we're just at the back of reception there's a wide open field nice grassed area just show you around quickly to the picnic area the back of the main reception block lovely night tonight and we'll head over towards the, the ten feet. Uh, yeah we'll stick a link at the bottom to the website so you can have a, a proper look and of course uh, it's in the tranquil parks brochure but there you can see a very very quick look at six static caravans and and there's a couple of pods down there okay so we're on the the main field a quick uh, few details now to our left so walking up that's our van 
all this side is all fully serviced the other side is all electric hook up so on this fully serviced pitch you've got your own tap you've got your own drain uh, all, all the normal normal services everything is close by so you don't need a I don't think you're ever going to need a 25 metre cable, are you? No. Some of the pictures you, uh, might be close, maybe 10 or 15 would certainly be something that would would be useful. It's a lovely site, it's well kept, the worn out with the, uh, with the mowers. And plenty of room on the pitch for you, your outfit and also the, uh, the cars. And walk along and really this is this is it so it's not a big site at all as we walk through the, the stone wall that's really as far as we're going to go uh, because it's got uh, these are seasonal pitches so you wouldn't be up here anywhere with your tour no nope. uh, we have got a post to our left which is the wi-fi which you have on site so there's uh, there's Wi-Fi points. I've noticed that some pictures there's even the cables which look like the satellite TV but I'm not 100% sure on that one. The sites are reasonably level. Some you can get away without without ramps but others you, you do need a touch don't you? Just yes, on your, just a little touch. Uh, you, just a uh, tweak as they say. Yeah, because you can't tell us we're walking, but we have actually we are actually walking downhill at the moment, so the so the pictures are, are sideways on. Just like I said, a tweak. Be able to see we've passed this this auto trail motor. So there's a little little bit of front to back there, isn't there? Yep. Uh, ours is side to side. Well, we just needed a touch of a, a touch of ramp, but generally the pictures are really good. Oh, we're watching a squirrel today ripping the tree to bits. <laughs> this afternoon it was quite nice. Nature, getting his food, getting what he wants and chucking them at us. Nice. So there you are. That's it really. That's the full length that we've walked of the, of the park. So it is very small. It is very compact. It's very tranquil. We don't... Um, you know what a fantastic little site well worth a visit if you're in the Peak District definitely alright so that's it Long Nor Wood from Tranquil Touring um, look it up the link's in the description fantastic little site till next time you take care stay safe and we'll catch you in the next one bye, bye.